Hello again, this is Bob from Northern Indiana. I thought while I was out doing a video or two, I'd, I'd finish up with this one for today. Uh, this came to mind that I've been watching uh, Mr. Pete 222, Tubal Kane. He's been uh, running a series on building of an engine very, very similar to this. Uh, this one I uh, believe I purchased uh, around 20 bucks one day from a little machine shop. Had some other tools that I ordered at that time, and that came along with it. But um, very simple machine to make. Um, gives you a lot of practice on uh, facing and uh, boring for the cylinder, uh, sizing the piston, uh, turning the flywheel, layout for your uh, your pivot and the two exhaust and intake. Uh, as you can see, it's just a very simple, simple little design, wobbler, uh, and didn't take long to do it. I suppose I did this in a week of evening, spent an hour or so of time uh, just fiddling around with it, and kind of a fun build. And anyway, I thought I'd show that, uh, and, and if you haven't seen it or followed it, why well, definitely look up and follow along with uh, with uh, Tubal Kane's videos on this. He's, he does a great job and I enjoy watching it even though I build it and still pick up on things that uh, I wish I'd have thought of. Um, put a little air to it here and see if we can get it to run. Guess if I get it running the right way make a big difference. We're running uh, oh, right around between 5 and 10 pounds, right around 5 pounds there, pressure there. Runs really nice. You can run the little engine once you get dialed in. Turn it down a little bit more. And for the money though, you can't go wrong. You get all the material you need. Uh, obviously, you probably have stuff laying around you could do this with pretty easily at this point in time. But as you can see, it's kind of a neat little engine. And if you're thinking of something you want to build quick or start off with, I would highly recommend it. And follow along Tubal Kane's build, uh, that, that's really helpful also. Anyway, that's it for right now. Uh, I'll sign off from northern Indiana.